So, Mr. Adam, when you came to our clinic first time, mm -hmm. you had so many problems yes. with your depression mm -hmm. and digestive issue, uh, mood swing. You was not feeling yourself. Right. Could you describe how you was feeling before when you came to our center of integrative medicine? Yes. So before uh, meeting Dr. Hawk, my life was pretty much the opposite. I used to feel um, very depressed, like all the time, um, very negative thinking. Um, also, like emotions, like my emotions pretty much control me like day to day and it was very very hard to get through pretty much the normal daily life like just waking up in the morning was difficult sometimes and it was for a very long time um and that also led me into having no motivation anywhere else in my life that I just let everything get, I guess, bad because I just didn't care for it. Um, you just living on the caffeine, that's what it means? Yeah, pretty much. Like, you just have no motivation. You just don't care anymore. Oh, you don't care anymore? No, you don't. You, you don't have no hope for your life. Mm -mm. You so stop caring about everything. 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 Hmm. Yep. Even yourself. And that's when things get bad because you start because you, you're trying to find a way to feel better mm. so you may run into things that are not so good for you that may give you some kind of like instant gratification but it's only temporary, temporary. It never, right it never fixes it it just mm -hmm. it's just a bad day did you try some specialized doctor who can give you some pills for depression and mental um, issues and you help you know digest trip right? yeah. and your energy motivation yeah so um the depression was something that i was not aware of actually because it was part of my life pretty much since i was a child and i just never noticed it mm. and it wasn't until i grew older and i got in a better place where i started to notice things about myself and one day i just paid attention to like one day of my life and I looked at it from like a perspective outside of me just observing without judgment and then I realized that it was pretty sad you know like it look happy it didn't look inviting my laugh did not look yeah I remember when you came yeah I remember when you came first time you was dragging your body yeah. you have no energy you know your skin was dark now you got back your skin yeah I'm so glad about that and yeah. uh, you digest you have a lot of digestion problem mm -hmm. how do you digest from right now you can digest food now yes it feels good um, it's really interesting like it's just like something that's going to the bathroom has become like a daily thing when you didn't used to like mm -hmm. I used to hold it for days and days yes oh, Wow. But I know that it's because of a lot of the foods that I would eat. Because mm -hmm. I will run to food to make myself try to make me feel better. So now are you are you eating healthy nowadays? Yes. yes. So maybe you can describe a little bit, you know, for our you know people who are watching. Yeah. They can get some motivated. Yeah. What after fixing your you know um, anxiety and depression after fixing your gut. Now, you, of course, you want to continue the healthy diet. Right. Can you describe a little bit, uh, shortly, what healthy eating you're following after being yes. recovered? Yes, so pretty much um, food is very important and that just uh, pretty much dictates how I feel now. So I try to be mindful about what I eat, which includes vegetables and fruits. A lot of the vegetables, I try to eat them as raw as possible like salads and sometimes I'll drizzle a little bit of like um, olive oil just keep healthy fats as well like avocados right. uh, vegan cheese vegan butter um, and even sometimes dessert like some Greek yogurt with no sugar and dark mm -hmm. chocolate and a little bit of honey and that's that's good that's actually and it's actually pretty delicious to delicious, eat like that yeah yeah so eating healthy fat eating healthy is very delicious very delicious yes. body is natural 
Yes. It click with the natural healthy food. Mm-hmm. Yes. You know, uh, we just need to learn it. A lot of time we are so much junk food around. Right. We forgot that our right food is yep. so, you know, so filling mm-hmm. and yeah. so nourishing. nourishing and, yeah. And body wants that. Yep. Just need to just learn and get used to it. Yes. And once you get used to it, the, the, the boom. Yes. It's very easy. Once, it's very once easy. you become educated, you actually crave it. You start craving yeah. the good food. Good food you crave. Because of how they make That's it. That's a very good cra- point though. It creates like a mental thing where you see something like Taco yeah. Bell or something and mm-hmm. mentally you're like, I don't I don't want that near me. Because you, know, you remember creates, how you feel. Yeah, how you it, it creates feeling. like a mental yes. like um mm-hmm. like an intense disliking for and just mentally yeah. thinking about it. It's like I yeah. already know what that path leads, so mm-hmm. I don't want that, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Yeah.